insert RoboCop related quote. Slice, glue, paint, enjoy. Good day to you all. It's Craigham here. And uh, oh, look, look, it's done. It's done. So, uh, a few of you may have seen a video recently I posted out called uh, the Easy to Build Redemptor Dreadnought. Now, I mean, what more can I say? The kit was £25, it was a bargain. And it's an amazing kit. It really is amazing. I mean, it's in the battle I've had, it's not been great, but I loved it. I loved it anyway, because I've got a giant walking Robocop. 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 Robocop robot. Um, walking around on my battlefield. And it's huge. It's a huge kit. So, as is this month, the comparison model is a play bearer. So you can see, look at that. Look at that. Um, it's a huge kit. Move out of the way. It's not your video. Not Nagel this week. Uh, and this is the finished result. So I normally don't do this, but uh, I'm going to. And I'm going to move the light. There we go. Because uh, there we go. Yeah, that's better. Uh, I don't normally do like a video on a single model or things like that. But this time I thought I had to because I really am chuffed with how this guy came out. And I haven't done a hobby bits in a while. So. This was the easy to build kit. It was £25 and it was a very static pose, so you only really got the, the, the bits what have been added are this saw here uh, and the rocket pod there. I haven't added anything else. I've seen people who have added things like the Dark Angels players and some Blood Angels players, but I didn't want to go too much. So, but I did want this, and this is the problem with the easy to build it doesn't come with the rocket pod, which gutted me after about two days of having the kit. So, with it, it was painted the same way with my special black mix for my uh, the darker bits and the corn red, <laughs> ironic, for the reds. And then this was actually a freehand um, saw. It was a lot of swearing over kind of time making it. Um, but it, and, oh, and I added this uh, in here. This was extra, actually, this little, uh, just going to stroke it. Look, pure seal. Um, yeah, and uh, also the skull, I threw that on the base. And you all see my uh, infamous herb based uh, scenery kit. Uh, some of the GW grass tufts. And yeah, I, I mean, in the first game it had, it failed terribly. Uh, but I went for the wrong target. I was fighting Eldar and I went for a Wraith Knight and it failed. So. But for overall, for a Hobby Bits little video, I thought, why not show you how he's come along? Because you've seen the army before, you've seen Seth and all of that. Um, but yeah, I think very good kit, because it, it does give a, a bit of convert convertibility, it does give a bit of posability. And it just look at it, it's a giant Robocop robot. No, I don't know, why wouldn't you want that? Uh, comment below and tell me if you've done anything with yours, because I love mine, so bing and a bang and a bosh. Share and share alike. I uh, hope you enjoy this hobby bits. This has been Kragum and the uh, giant Robocop, Robocop, Robocop robot. Uh, saying a goodbye. Just stare into the eye slot. Stare into the eye slot. Go on. Click on another link. Because that's what you want to do. That's what you want to do.